Let's say you would like to quickly trim your YouTube video after you uploaded it, or you'd like to trim and cut your video with more options and control before you upload it. Hello everyone, my name is Tim, and in this video I'll show you how this can be done very quickly, so let's get started. In this video I'll show you how you can trim your videos in the YouTube studio, then how to trim your videos quickly and easily with Veed, and in the end how to export your trimmed video to your device. Okay, so first off, head over to youtube.com and go to your YouTube studio. After that, find content in the left menu, then search for the video you would like to trim and click on the pen tool. Once you're in the edit section, click on editor on the left hand side. In this section, you can trim the video you've uploaded to YouTube. To start trimming, click on trim in the menu and simply drag the playhead in the timeline to the starting point from the footage you would like to take out. Next, click on split in the bottom section of your screen and click and drag the blue vertical line to the point you would like to let it start again in the timeline. And now the darker part will be excluded from the footage. You can repeat the steps and trim like this throughout the entire video. And after that, simply click on save to save the trimmed video in the YouTube studio. Now, personally, I would like to have more control and clarity while doing my edits. So in this case, I'm gonna use Veed in order to trim my video. To get started, simply go to Veed.io in your browser. You can create an account for free. Or click on the first link in the description to go straight to the website. Once you're on the homepage, click on upload your video, then click on upload a file, select the video clip you would like to trim, and then click on open. After a short moment, your video is imported. Now we're ready to trim the video. In this video, only certain bits where I'm talking are relevant for the video. The rest can be cut out of the footage. So first thing we do is click on the sound wave button on the right to see the audio of the video in the bottom timeline. The audio waves that are relatively bigger or stand out usually indicate the talking parts of the video. This will help us trim the video for the relevant bits. To start trimming, we'll be using the playhead in the bottom timeline. You can move the playhead around by clicking and dragging it to the preferred part of the video. For now, I want to remove the non-talking bits, so I'll place the player just before I start talking. Now we can use two methods to start trimming the video. You can either click and drag the size of the file in the timeline towards the position the player is located, or simply click on split in the timeline menu to split the video in two, and delete the irrelevant footage by clicking on the backspace or delete button on your keyboard. After that, drag the entire file to the left, so the video starts at that specific point. Okay, to speed up the process, we'll be filtering out every single relevant talking part of the video all at the same time. To make this happen, once again, place the playhead before the point you start talking, click on split, and then place the playhead to the points where you stop talking, and again, click on split. In this example, like I said before, I repeat these steps and cut out every single relevant talking part of the video. Oh, and before you split the footage, make sure you keep clicking on the file in the timeline you would like to cut. After that, we delete the parts that are not relevant. Simply click on the files you would like to delete, and again, click on the backspace or delete button on your keyboard to remove them from the timeline. After that, align the relevant parts by clicking and dragging them to the left side of the timeline. To create a better oversight of your trimmed clips, click on fit timeline on the right hand side. You can always further trim and extend your footage by clicking and dragging on the sides in the timeline if that's necessary. If you would like to add more footage, simply click on the plus button in the timeline. For now, I'll just leave it as it is. Okay, so once you're happy with the trimmed video, you can export it. To export the video, find the export button on the right top corner, then click on export video. After the video is rendered, click on the download mp4 button to download the video straight to your device. And that's how you quickly and easily trim your videos. And that's it for this video. Please give it a like if it helped you out and consider subscribing and become a part of the Veed community. If you have a question or a very nice thing to say, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section so we can get back to you. For more helpful tips and tricks, feel free to watch our other content on this channel. For now, have a nice day, good luck and see you later.